Welcome back. In this video, we are going to install Redux Toolkit in our React application. So let's get going. So let's follow the documentation of Redux Toolkit. So let's head over to Google and then search for Redux Toolkit. Like so. So let's search for that and click on the first search. And there we go. Now we are in a home page of what? Redux Toolkit. All right. So let's click on getting started and then scroll down and look at the installation the first is let's create our create react app okay so let's go to our terminal i have my terminal being open here so i'm going to initiate create react app script like that and then the name of my project let me label it as redux toolkit all right, so let me hit enter. Sorry, it's not like that, but like this Redux Toolkit. Okay, so it is bootstrapping it for me. So while it's installing, let's head over to the documentation and continue exploring it. All right, so first thing is that we need to install what is called Redux Toolkit after you finish installing what React app. All right, so we can use whether um, using npm or yarn. I prefer to use yarn. So if you are using Redux Toolkit, first you need to install Red, their Toolkit package and then React Redux because Redux can be used in other frameworks. But you don't need to install Redux separately. Previously, you need to install Redux separately, but with Redux Toolkit, you don't need to install that. So you install this Redux Toolkit and React Redux. And there we go. All right, so let's head over to our terminal and see whether it has finished. Yeah, mine has finished. So let me cd into Redux Toolkit like that. So let me open it using my preferred code editor, VS Code. All right, so let me open it here in a different window, make it large and i have my fresh react application all right so the next thing is let's install react redux sorry um let's install what redux toolkit sorry guys so here let's copy that go to our terminal clear my console like that and then let me paste the script and then next we need to install react redux as well react redux okay so let me hit enter and it's bootstrapping it so that's all what you need to get react redux and redux toolkit installed in your application all right so let's head, let's check if it has finished installing let's go to my package.json file and let's see dependencies where is it where is it my dependencies there we go you see i have redux toolkit and react redux this is all what you need to get react toolkit up and running all right so in the next video we will start diving into the api of redux toolkit